Hello, I'm William Warren. I live in Las Vegas. I have posted several videos um, trying to report radiation and the fallout. It may be coming over the area of it. And um, I don't have I don't have a means to calibrate those the Geiger counter except what I did uh, when I first started recording the videos. I uh, zeroed it out. I actually brought it down from uh, two and a half rims to zero it out. And since then, we've been watching that needle slowly climb again. I have given it tests, like I brought it from inside when it was cooler to the outside, and I did the opposite to make sure that there's no atmospheric conditions uh, affecting what you can read on the meter. So, I did do that, but I lack having a radioactive source where it can actually be tuned it in and then I'd know exactly what the background radiation sits. But as I uh, see it now, it's twice the background radiation as when I first started recording. That was the mean norm. Now that looks like the, the, neck, the new mean norm. I can't say again, like how we recorded earthquakes, there's not as much data with radiation background like well I've had this thing for years I should have been doing this I had years of logs but I don't know what that looked like so I really don't know what it looked like over a typical time period anyways as I'm sure a lot of the readers are so um, when I picture the fallout coming through the air I can see it just disappearing and uh, just one atom of that plutonium is death that's it one sixtieth millionth of a part and you're done. And somewhere in the air, there's that one magical atom going to be whipping through, and it might hit you. These are like ricochet bullets, and they're everywhere. Some of them are going to settle out, and that's uh, a lot of what they're finding in the milk because the cows are acting like a filtering source. So they're out there eating that large area of the land, and all that grass they're eating, somewhere on it, may be a particle of lead. You know, so what um, they hate had their milk, and the radiation is showing up in the milk. You're gonna see it more in the corn. You're gonna see it everywhere. It's just the way it is. And uh, it's only gonna be like a filter to get it out of the system. What I've been doing here in my backyard is I've scraped this. That's kind of deep. I have to have a lot of calcium in the dirt to not to show up. It's like a deep to this way to the top of it. Okay, so presumably, you see, I started in a good area, and somewhere I can get my whole backyard topsoil into one location. And inside there, there is a plutonium atom, and that's our concern mostly that it will show up. Um, it won't be easy. <laughs> but I'm going to do it, and then we're going to come back and we're going to see what that test looks like. Alright, thanks for watching.